Hey, what's going on YouTube? J. Jamo back again with the next bit. Robin, best cases I've seen for this phone, only cases I've seen for this phone on Amazon UK is this Osley Fusion. What's it called? Next bit Fusion bumper case and this Tudia case. So um, I'm going to just show you what they look like. Give them a little bit of an unboxing. I'm going to put the phone here for a second um, and let's see what's really good. Do you want to read the stuff on the back? What to expect? Protection, guaranteed quality, perfectly designed for your device, premium materials and build quality. Prizes to be won. Oh, prizes to be won. I'm going to have to try that in a second. Um, they've got a couple of, you know, social media outlets there, so you can go and check that. Um, and yeah, quite a bit of um, literature up there that you can read if you've got the time. This is the case. Got a nice little um, 2D... <coughs> Next bit, Robin right here, which is quite live. I think I'll um I'll use this in future. Oh, it's it. Oh, it's even got the back, guys. I can't even tell them apart. Look at that. Can you even look? Can you even tell them apart? Seriously, I bet you can't. I actually legitly bet you cannot tell these apart. But anyway, <laughs> I'm gonna put that down. This is the case, so I can see that I've got all the ports that I need there. Um, I've got some kind of protective film, so I'm just going to take that off there, stick that somewhere. And I think there's another protective film inside as well. If I can just, if I can just get that and peel that off there. Um, and let's, you know, put it in and see if all my ports are lining up. So there we go. Nice snug fit. Fits with the design. Got a little bit of a plastic bit over there, so you can see that, guys. Let me just bring that closer to you. Um, nice and square, like the design as well. Clear cutouts for the camera, clear cutouts for the headphone jack, it seems. Clear cutouts for the volume controls, clear cutouts for the USB C, and what is that at the bottom? I'm not even sure what that is. What, what is that? What is that at the bottom? I'm not sure what that second hole is for. <laughs> um, but yeah, the second hole is there, and yeah. Looks quite decent. Clear cut out for the fingerprint sensor. Let me just make sure that the fingerprint sensor isn't obstructed. So we'll turn that off. Three, two, one. Yep. Seems quite cool. Seems cool to me. Three, two, one. Oh. Ah, uh, you got. To, it makes it a little bit awkward for you to press the fingerprint sensor. You got kind of. Got kind of. Get your thumb in there. Yeah, it does make it awkward to press the fingerprint sensor, but um, I suppose that's all right. Um, I'm not sure if that's all right, actually. Wait, hold on, let me try again. Yeah, it's making... My success rate on pressing the fingerprint sensor has definitely been affected by this now. Uh, let me try that again one more time. Right, what if I try like this with this finger? Yeah, that's all right, because I can get my... My thumb is too fat to fit in this narrow gap. But, um, yeah, that's the Osley bumper case. Looks quite decent. I'll put the link in the description for this case um, below. Yes. So let me get that out of there. Let's put that to the side. In here, we have got the Tudia case. Let me get that open. Now, the Tudia case is looking a bit more beefy. We've got this metallic plate on the back. We looks like we got all the cutouts that we need there. Very nice indeed. So um, let's get it plugged in. Those volume buttons look really dope there. Can you guys see that? Look at those volume buttons. Fam. What's this design we've got inside as well? 2D Emerge, got some branding there. Do we have any branding on the Osley? Um, ah, we do have branding on the Osley. I beg your pardon, right there. There you go, bit of branding. So, um, yeah, I was a bit reluctant to get this case because I wanted to keep with the blue and grey, um, what's it called, effect and theme of the next bit rubbing. But, um, you know, we've got to try something different nowadays. So let's chuck that in there, see how it feels. Okay. Okay, feels decent. And then we're going to put that on. Oh, what's this? 2D Emerge. All right. I'm not sure where they put that in there, but there you go. I'm not sure of the point of this little back bit here. Am I supposed to have it on or does it... Can I... 
does it clip it in even harder or something? I'm, I'm not sure. Let's make sure that's all clipped in. Uh, there we go. Gives the phone a completely different design aesthetic. But uh, I think it's quite decent. Definitely quite shockproof. Um, feels quite cool. Kind of hides the sexiness of the phone. Like now you can't even see the little um the lights that tell you when the phone is sinking. But um, can I get to the fingerprint sensor? Oh, I tell you what. I can get to it a lot easier in this case. 100% unlock rate like that. Ah. Yeah, definitely. Hold on, let me just try that again. Definitely a lot better of the fingerprint sensor there. Let me just check all the ports for you guys. Um, fingerprint sensor port, obviously cool. Headphone port and microphone, cool. Um, the buttons, let's see if that actually works because they got some funky thing going on there. Oh, there we go. Yep, so it makes your volume buttons come out a bit more, which is quite cool. There we go. Nice and easy, and you can still hear the clicks. Yeah, very decent indeed. Um, What's going on at the bottom there? Still got your USB-C port going on there. Um, Very nice, very nice indeed. So yeah, um... In terms of looks, I would definitely say I like the plain um, feel of this one. I can imagine this one getting dirty really quickly with that back glass. Um, but in terms of, you know, <laughs> actually working with the fingerprint sensor, I would definitely say the 2 d case is winning over the Orsley. But yeah, um, let me know what case you're going to decide for your next bit, Robin, if you have one, or let me know any other cases that you've seen on Amazon that I could try out. But yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Leave a comment in the comment section below. Subscribe and like if you haven't already. And if you have, I will catch you in the next one. Um, yeah, thanks for watching. J Jamo out.